All right, everybody. Welcome back to what the hell? Haha, <laughs> here we go. Oops. Welcome back to Donkey Kong Country. Minecart Madness. You can just imagine how many times I'm going to die this one, right? Oh boy. Ow. Ow. Oh boy. Oh crap! This is actually very. Oh no! Whoa! Oh, this is way different than the last minecart stage. What the hell? It's super different. Screw it up again. Nice! I got to a different minecart. Okay. Cut. That was kind of cool. Who the hell set up all these deadly minecarts? Oh, what? That sucked. An anonymous gifter gifted a sub to the Lightning God and Super Slay gifted a sub to cats like Jake. Thank you for all these gifted subs. <clears throat> okay, here we go. What the holy hell? Uh. I guess I wasn't supposed to jump out at all. Oh, I screwed up. Oh, that was a tire I could have bounced on, huh? Oh, what? Oh. Damn it. Damn it. Well then. <laughs> Alrighty then. Let's try that again, shall we? You can understand why people said that these minecart stages were insanely tough. Well, I screwed up and missed that. Banana. I jumped too early. What the? What sucks here is that when you get hit by something, that's it, you're screwed because your other character keeps his momentum and misses the cart completely. it again. Damn it. Okay. Not the checkpoint. Oh my god, we're supposed to jump.
He didn't bounce. I jumped and landed on the tire. I press. I pressed jump. He didn't bounce. Okay. He didn't bounce. What is it? He passes through tires and doesn't bounce on them. I don't understand that. You should think if you're, if you're jumping on a rubber tire, you should just bounce off of it. For some reason, they're like they're saying you're clipping through it and it's not counting when I'm obviously touching the tire. That's weird, man. Huh. All right, try it again. Okay. Crap. I thought I could just stay in the car. No, I just keep getting hit. Oh my god. Whoa, that was close. Yeah, see? I actually hit the tire, but it doesn't it doesn't register like I hit it. It's weird, man. Okay. God! You get to that barrel. What? You've got to be kidding me. I got all the way and then the freaking there's a dude there and I couldn't jump. I pressed jump and it didn't do anything. He landed, I pressed jump, and I just walked right into it. He didn't jump over it. I don't know how to hit, how to do that 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 tire. I've jumped on it multiple times. It doesn't ever count. of tires to the left. Holy crap, man. Okay. That's it. I did it. Cool. <clears throat> Woo! Alright. So there's a barrel flights. What's next? Blackout basement? Yeah, I'm going to save. Fuck that. I'm going to save. Oh, let's see. Firm High Five has did 100 bit cheer. And he's asking me, how am I going to physically prepare for the 12-hour marathon? Two wait, number one, I'm gonna have a breakfast that day, which a lot of the times I don't do. I'm gonna eat some kind of a breakfast that morning. Um, number two, I have both water, fruit juice, and energy drinks all lined up. 
to make sure that I am energized during the day. I have snacks like granola and granola bars, peanuts, that kind of stuff. I have ready and lined up. Um, I bought some lunch meat, sandwich meat, so I can have like normal, like a sandwich or something during the day. Some fruit I bought to have some fruit and, and, and energy in me. So, you know, I'm basically doing all that stuff. And I'm going to make sure I get a really good night's sleep that night before. So that way I'm nicely rested and ready for that marathon. Because it's true, I have to be gaming for 12 hours. I need to be energized. I need to be ready and entertain you guys. Because I, you know, to try to raise as many tips as I can on that show, that, that marathon show, I have to be up to the task. So, it's this Saturday, Colonel B, though. This Saturday. Okay. What the? Oh. This is weird. Lights are going on and off. I'm just gonna be careful. When the light goes off, I'm gonna just like, not move. How the hell do I get that? How in the holy hell would I get that swordfish without dying? Like that! Cool, you roll and then jump. That was cool. Tire bounce. Get out of here. Bonk, get out of here. Get you in the dark, asshole. Now we got a moving platform in the dark. Wow. Double combo in the dark. Light, this light situation hasn't really been that big of a deal. Oh god! Made it nice! Whoa! He tried to chop me. What is this? Ah, the platform went down. Triple stop! Oh, hidden barrel. Sweet. Nice. Got him. Oh boy. I got the Kong. Oh, if I still had the barrel, I could have broken this for a hidden room. Yeah, I needed that middle barrel right here. That's it. Nice. I aced that one, dude. That was perfect. I didn't die once. That was really sweet. Boss Dumb Drum? <clears throat> it's probably the boss. Let's go save again. That was good stuff. I actually did really good. <clears throat> I didn't get the secret room, though, because I didn't have the barrel. Very nice. Okay. What do you mean, seriously? It's Mr. Benson. Seriously? What? Was that a hard stage for you? 
All right, time for a boss. Boss Dome Drum. Let's see what this is. Whoa. Oh, shit. What do I do? I thought maybe you could hit him. Nope. How do I hit this guy? Uh... Oh! So far, I haven't seen a single opportunity to hit this boss. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's see. Real Talk Play Apex Trudy said, Mod me wants to know if I ever dated a strong, independent black woman. None of your business. How about that? <laughs> I don't know what to do. That was it? Are you serious? That was the whole boss. All you had to do was dodge. Well. <laughs> that was pretty easy. Alright, Mr. Papavera Charity said, A testament to this game. When I was subscribed to the Nintendo Power 25 years ago and getting a VHS promotional tapes, I was excited to get my hands on a copy. This game really flexed the SNES muscles. I'm remembering all of this. The gameplay I remember too. I was also dying a lot, but really enjoying it. You eventually get a feel for the game and get better, and I can imagine the focus on my face must have been pretty intense. All right. People are saying this is the last world. I should save my game again then, shouldn't I? I mean, I guess I could just I could just save state because I could technically I could just go back to the girl. I don't feel like doing that. So we'll just do a save state. There you go. Okay, tanked up trouble. Excuse me. Oh, was I supposed to grab that? There was a secret! I got it! Uh, la la la. Okay. Yoink. So I have to keep getting fuel barrels. These stages really do remind me of Mario. Oh, come on now. He bounced super low. No Cactus God, the stream is many, many, many games. The Marathon Street coming up this Saturday is going to be Donkey Kong Country, probably two, I'm thinking. Um... Super Mario RPG, Classic Street Fighter, Black Ops 4 Blackout, um, and Sekiro. So it's going to be a good variety of stuff mixed in. It's not just Sekiro, don't worry. It'll have a segment of Sekiro, maybe a couple hours of Sekiro, but that's about it. It's not going to be the whole thing for sure.
That sucked. La 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 la. La 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 la. Oh, come on! I missed the platform, son of a bitch. All right. You gotta be kidding. Walked right into him like an idiot. <laughs> Walked right into him. Because I'm stupid. That's right, Donkey Kong. You beat that chest, son. Wait a minute. I could be getting the secret life every single time, huh? I could, right? Yet I'm not doing it because I'm stupid. Good, you know, good eyesight. It's very easy to see the last one. This is what I should have been doing. I should have been getting the extra life every single time I played, so that way, if I lost one, I was good. Yeah, I love that. He just beats his chest randomly. Back when Rare was still a good game developer. Makes me sad. I was doing well, then I failed. Okay. Yep. Easy peasy. La la la. La la la. Okay, continuing on. <clears throat> Who put all these levitating barrels of fuel around this cave? And how does that work exactly? Bonus! Triple bonus! The fish is actually the slowest of all the creatures, I think, when it comes to collecting the stars. It seems like he's really slow. 
The other creatures get way more, way more uh, gold icons than the fish. I can usually only get three lives out of this anyway. I think only once did I get four. And somebody adding me to the 225 bit series said, Sup, feel ready for the Danky Kang 2 playthrough. To Danky Kang, huh? Dude, it put us back at the beginning. We have to do the whole stage over, yeah. It put us right back at the beginning of the stage, damn. I mean, I appreciate getting three extra lives, but... <laughs> doing the whole thing over is a little, uh... A little annoying. Not that this stage is super challenging, you just kind of need to know what to do. I thought for sure there was a cannon there because there was a trail of bananas. There wasn't. They baited me. They totally baited me. A hundred percent baited. What the? Dropped my input. Push this tire? Oh shit. There we go. Oh crap, I missed the end. Well, nothing I can do about that now. mistake a horrible and horrid mistake gonna sit here and complain constantly about the commentary then don't then don't be here goodbye seriously someone just sitting there 
It's commentary sucks. It's too big. Shut the fuck up. I'm playing a platformer trying to concentrate. What should I do? Be telling you about some fucking stories from my past as I try to fucking play this super hard platformer? How about this? Eat a dick and get the fuck out. Jesus Christ. Some people, man. Alright. Trying to concentrate now. Is here. Yep. Fuck. Fuck. Touch them, fuck it. What? It glitched! Did you see that? I grabbed the fuel, it didn't count. It's what was that? It grabbed the fuel and didn't move. What on earth was that? What the heck? Not sure what happened. La la la. At least it's nice calming music during this stage. Screwed over. I got screwed. I was screwed. Oh, come on! Seriously? The first jump? 
Thank you to, to an anonymous gifter who gifted a sub to Bobby Ling. Congrats, Bobby. Ugh. Oh, fuck. Well, I'm screwed. First time the barrel roll or the uh, first time the tire rolled off the platform for me. I'm about to be done. I have no lives left. I guess it was a secret. Yeah, if I wanted to get the letter, I had to do that. Well, I don't care about that shit. Killed himself. I did it. Oh, man. All right. So, if this were the normal game, I would literally leave this stage, go back to one of the, the, the uh, Candy Kong and save manually. But since we have save states, I'm just going to use them. I did it on my last life, too. Okay. <clears throat> AVG and Mike Matei were stuck there for hours. Were they seriously? They were stuck on that stage for hours? <laughs> Did they actually play this game as kids? Because I never played it as a kid. It's the first time I've ever played it, and I just beat it in like 10 minutes. <laughs> I'm just saying. Then again, keep in mind, I am a, a basically professional gamer... It is my job to game versus theirs it's not. There's to make entertaining videos and, and reviews. Oh shit. Alright, so much for that. Oh, I got back on him. Woo! Oh yeah. Rhino's cool and all, but he's a little delayed. Oh my god. Nice. Done. Oh, never mind. There's some, some good places to. Oh shit! I found it completely by accident. What? Fuck. That sucked. Oh, he killed himself. <laughs> Committed suicide. Come on now! I was clearly standing on it. I was clearly standing on it.
Oh my god! That platform looks out of place. It looks like the platform's supposed to move or something. I don't know. What? Annoying. You big stupid doof. God damn it. <sighs> What's this one called, by the way? Manic what? Manic mincers. Could you do that to me? Ow. Well, he's dead. Use my invisibility to my advantage. What the hell are these things supposed to be? Big grinding gears or some shit. Like, what the fuck? Boom. Okay. Mincers. I never even heard about mincer until this game. Fucking mincer. They're all vomiting up bananas. It's disgusting. A lot of bananas and a life. Nice. Mr. Papa Vera Charity says, I have noticed that a common occurrence in your playthroughs is interesting to your playstyle. You breeze through part of the game that's many have struggled, but then get stuck on a part that is meant to be easy, but get through it nonetheless! Everyone says that, too. Everyone says that I beat hard stages quickly, but then easy stages I die to, like, right away. I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know, man. Certainly don't ask me why that is. I have no idea. Nice. Fuck you. Screw you. Triple boop. Oi! That was close. Huh. Oh, man. Huh? I got the G. I got the real G. And I got the froggy. And then I walked right into a freaking mole. Actually, those are moles. Those are beavers, right? That's what Cat pointed out to me. She's like, those aren't moles. Those are beavers. I was like, what? And then I looked. I was like, you're right. They have those flat beaver tails. They're beavers. Uh, all right. The Misty Mine. Okay. So once again, I should make a save point. Again, if this were the real game on SNES, I would just back out, go to a candy save point, and come back. But I'll save myself some time by just making the restore point here. Okay. When did Cassie the Beaver? She watched the LP. Cat played this game back in the day. She said it was one of her games from her childhood. And she watched a little bit of my playthrough because she wanted to see how I did in it. So yeah. Huh.
All right, what is this? Misty Mines? A lot of snakes. Then we're kidding. This shit is misty as shit, man. Ah, oh, crap. I needed the barrel to blow that one up to get the rhino. And I can't get the rhino. Well, that's a bunch of duty. Crap, I didn't mean to do that. I bet all the secrets in this area you have to destroy the barrels. The misty mines of Moria, where the dwarves dug too deep. Oh yeah, lots of jumping. Hi yeah yeah. Dodge all those beavers. I thought they were moles. I really did. Oh shit. Ah, I missed the ostrich. Fucking. Oh yeah, I can't reach it. I went to the mist. The mist the mist went away. Damn, I bet there was a secret right there in that hole. Oh, mist is coming back. Whoa. Armadillo. Oh, armadillo. Armadillo. Oh, it came after me, but I dodged him anyway. Oh no! Ah! Oh! I made it. I got like no letters, but I made it on the first try. All right, Funky's flights. Loopy lights. Well, once again, I would backtrack, but I'm just gonna save. Okay. Beat on the first shot, pretty good. All right, Loopy lights is next. What's up, a good RPG? Good to see you, man. Hello, young Guap Fresh. Good to see you as well. Loopy Lights. That was the first jumping gator in the entire game. Not a single gator up to now has jumped. Aha! Uh -huh. Did it again! Are you kidding me? Damn it, man. Excuse me. He still got me! Son of a bitch. Loopy lights. I have no expectations for Sekiro at all. I'm literally going in blind on purpose because I don't I never wanted to be spoiled on the game, so we'll just see what it is when I play it. Okay. 
It so it jumps when you jump, but it stays on the ground if you stay on the ground. How do I get past it? How do I get past it? Oh. Ooh, la, 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 la. Oh, I don't even know how I hit it. I have no idea how I hit it. Checkpoint, yes. Oh no. Phew. Oh god, the bees, not the bees! How the fuck? Okay. Oh! No! 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 I was right there, man. Mr. Papa Very Cheery says, Are you into civilization type games? Don't know if available yet to get on Wii U. There's another SNES favorite with pretty graphics and nice music. Really hard platforming called Act Tracer. <clears throat> I played Act Tracer back in the day when it was new. I rented it once or twice. You're absolutely right. The graphics were great for the time, but the game was hard as shit. So I never got too far. Um, no, I don't. I never played a Civ game, so I wouldn't know anything about that. <clears throat> What the fucking fudge rucker? God damn it. God damn it. Same thing happened last time. Mm.
Whoa, that was a lucky bounce. Get me out! No! That was so evil. That was so evil. They put him right at the end. Oh. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Damn, dude. 